Hi guys, today I'm playing with a 505 driven flyback transformer driver. Um, it's the circuit I found on the internet but I've modified for much better performance and it gives some really good arcs on the output. Um, I can audio modulate it too and it sounds quite good. So I shall show you some arcs now. This is the driver itself. Um, I'm only using one of those MOSFETs. Uh, it's a big heat sink, so I use it for other projects. And there's a small like MOSFET socket thing, which is an old ATX uh, three-pin fan connector for a computer. Uh, the modifications I've made to this circuit are instead of using two, um, I think they're 10k resistors, uh, potentiometers. I've used two 50k pots. And that allows me to fine tune the frequency to get the best arc. And here, here's the most important thing: uh, this filter capacitor. And there's another smaller one here, and that goes in parallel with the um, 505 timer driver, and that helps protect protect it against um, back EMF spikes. I think without it, my driver would have already died. And on the flyback itself, I am using. Uh, it's about 10 turns, I think. I've had to hot glue it because it was arcing around the base pins. And there's the return pin. 12 volt, uh, 7 amp hour lead sealed lead acid battery. Um, it works quite good for this as long as you keep it um, top top. They don't like it if they go below uh, a certain percentage of charge. Well, this MOSFET is uh, quite warm right now. It's not hot, but it's warm. Uh, so it's doing its job good, keeping the MOSFET cool. Uh, the flyback, um, it was warm. It's still a bit warm now, but that's about it. Alright guys, um, hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching, and goodbye.